yeah, I think that's a really interesting topic to, you know, talk about general education. And, you know, obviously, you know me as an education chair, right? And I'm really right. big on education, but I am not really big on systemized education, if, if that makes sense. It's kind of like I went to college and, and I got my degrees, but I always say I got an MBA by going through the birth of fire, by working for corporations and learning their systems and coming out being paid for it and better educated for it at the same time versus sitting in a classroom applying theories that potentially are outdated. Yeah, a lot of these young kids coming out of, coming out of school today, my, my kids included, I've got uh, 14, 15, and 17-year-old, and um, I, you know, the, 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 the path is just so undefined. And if they know exactly what they want to do and, and the path it takes to get there and college is in that path, then I'm all for it. But if it's, um, you know, if, if they, you know, my son right now is talking about being a welder um, and then even taking it further wants to be an underwater welder nice. and he thinks that's really cool so what we're doing is we sit down and look at what is what does the path look like for that position and you know a traditional four-year college is probably not the way to go for that career path so we've taken a look at three or four different paths that he can take and and if he chooses not to go to college and take that career path i will support him 100 percent because i i have so many friends that have gone to college and gotten their master's degree and in, in whatever it is their 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 major is and then they don't ever work a single day in that field. Yeah. It's like a lot of people go to get an education just to have the piece of paper and then go do something that they really want to do. If, if people would learn early on to focus on what it is that you really want to do and then take a few steps backwards and say, okay, how do I achieve that? Yeah. You know, why, why go to school for this? Like in your case, right? You went to school for some very specific things because you knew which direction you were headed. That's a smart decision. It wasn't my decision to begin with, though. <laughs> <laughs> I mean, when looking back at it, 2020 being hindsight, I mean, I definitely appreciate them throwing me in, in, in art school. But, you know, at the same time, like realizing that I needed more analytical data as well, too. But that, that comes with experience. It comes with time. Yeah. No, that's that's the hard thing that you can't teach anybody is time um, and the, the things you learn along the way. And I, I tell people all the time, just slow down, learn as you go. Don't rush through this stuff because you know, 27 years for me has gone by in a flash and it's, it's been amazing. Um, I, I did slow down and I learned a lot along the way. Um, I feel like I have a little bit to give back now. And, and, and I think that's why I love doing this so much because I get to educate people and, and help people. And with the networking group as well, uh, I've helped a few people inside the SCN network with a few things in their companies. And I, I enjoy doing that. You know, when someone calls me out of the blue and says, Hey, can I ask you a question? I need help with this. I'm like, yeah, I'll cancel the rest of my day and talk to you. Hmm. So I love it. 